Hello my dudes and welcome or welcome back to a new video. Today we are going to be reacting to the newest collection Sorry, I just cracked my knuckle. Today we're going to be reacting to the newest holiday collection that is coming out this year from Jellycat. They just posted all of the actual listings on the site. Nothing's available for purchase yet, but I haven't gotten to look. I just know that they're up and I'm really excited to see what we're gonna get for this Halloween and Christmas. So let's go ahead and take a look. Can I just say that ever since Jellycat updated their website, I just, I love it so much. It's so much easier to navigate. So we're gonna go to collections and we're going to go to the coming soon page and I know as soon as I click this it's going to like kind of give me a bit of a spoiler so let's get ready okay all right we're here I immediately see a lot of Halloween babies I'm very excited about that I cannot explain how obsessed I am with this vampire Ricky rain frog oh my gosh can we talk about his little teeth can we talk about his little teeth? <laughs> he is so stinking cute. That cape is adorable. $40 is a little steep. That's the only thing I don't like about the new Ricky Rain Frogs that come out is that like I already have an OG Ricky Rain Frog and sometimes I just want the accessories and I don't wanna pay for an entirely new Ricky Rain Frog. What can you do? We have the Skeleton Bob bag charm, also adorable. I'm so happy they're coming out with more bag charms. I think it's really nice. I love putting them on my bags and stuff. Bartholomew Bear Bat, who I actually did see in my most recent Jelly Hunt video. You should check that out. A little self promo there. Bashful Pumpkin Bunny, oh my gosh, he's holding a little pumpkin. He's so cute. All right, we're gonna scroll. Oh my gosh. Skella Dog Dan, Skella Bat Jim. These names are incredible. All of the skeleton designs, I don't know why, but they they remind me of childhood for some reason, like because they're cutesy and they remind me of enjoying Halloween as a kid. Those two are very cutie babies. The price isn't too bad. We have Mummy Bob, oh my gosh. So Skeleton Bob, but Mummy Bob, adorable. I love the attention to detail with the stitching where they kind of made it show that it's like older bandages with the little X's and stuff. I like that a lot, I really do. Yuki Spider looks very cute. I'm very curious if maybe he has beans in his legs. I doubt it because they are very small. I'm sure they're just like a little flimsy. If he had beans in his little legs though, that would be so cute. All right, scrolling further. Do -do -do. Oh, okay, okay. We're getting into some Christmas ones. Jesse Snowman. Interesting, interesting, interesting. I like him. He's really cute. This looks like the kind of guy I would put on like a mantle or a shelf for Christmas decor. And not in a bad way. I love doing that. I love putting plushies up as decor. It's very fun. He is cute. I'm wondering his fur texture looks kind of interesting kind of reminds me of brook otter that just came out that same like look to it i don't know if it's the same but they look very similar we have the toasty eggplant he's very cute i like the toasty jelly cats the ones that have like the earmuffs and stuff i think they're really cute especially the bunnies i think oh my gosh okay we've got some ornaments ricky rain frog santa hat ornament is amazing i'm definitely getting that for my tree this year monroe scotty dog and festival folly pear ornaments as well if i could have have my Christmas tree just entirely covered in jelly cats, that would be ideal. Got Bashful Bunny with Christmas tree and a candy cane. I love when they hold things. They look so cute like holding things. <laughs> $28 isn't too bad, but at the same time, it's one of those things where like what I said with the Ricky Rain Frog, I would like it if it weren't for the fact that this is basically the same jelly cat I already own with one extra accessory and I'm paying a whole $28. But Anyway, Bashful Cranberry Bunny. Oh my gosh, look at that color. That is so pretty. That is perfect for Christmas time. Beautiful color. I love Bashful Bunnies, but everyone loves Bashful Bunnies. They have some more ornaments. Bashful Puppy Decoration. And the Bartholomew Bear, that little scarf. Can we talk about that little pom-pom on the end of Bart's scarf? Oh my goodness, that's so cute. Amusable's Bobble Avocado. Look at those pom-poms too. <laughs> I'm obsessed. The tiny black and cream puppy as a decoration for your Christmas tree. Exquisite. 10 out of 10. No notes. <gasps> immediately going on my wish list oh my gosh i okay <laughs> the amusables peanut is so popular and i don't really get it but this this guy right here amazing immediately want immediately oh my gosh look at his nose it's so cute he is so so freaking adorable oh my gosh that was i have to have him as soon as this drops oh my gosh amusables tree cookie and star cookie i love making gingerbread houses in christmas time amusables nordic spruce wreath 
that's very specific. I very much like that. That's very pretty. That's something I would genuinely decorate my door with. A musicals gingerbread house is what it's called. So these three all together would be so cute. Oh my goodness. And then we got some books. If I had kids, I would totally get like all of these books. <laughs> okay, we have Yummy Penguin, another jelly for the yummy line. Very cute. I do like the yummies. I don't have any. And there's not like a line that I would go out of my way to purchase. I do think they are very cute though. We have Vivian Reindeer. Hmm. I like the coat. It's very cute. This isn't my style per se. I'm not a fan of the glittery paws because I just know that material is a little scratchy and not my thing. A little too cutesy for my taste. I like a simpler design. Still adorable though because it's still a jelly cat. Next row down. Oh boy. <laughs> Oh boy. Hold on. We gotta take a look at this boy. <laughs> Snowman Timmy Turtle. I actually really like Timmy Turtle and I don't have a Timmy Turtle in my collection. This guy is so freaking cute. That's such a great idea. Good job, Jellycat. <laughs> Whoever's designing your plushies, give them a kudos from me because this is amazing. We have Theo Turkey. Not my thing, but he's cute. I like his little hat. I like his little hat. Christmas Tree Ricky Rain Frog is very cute as well. I like the little outfit. Not one I would think I would get, but if I was gifted this or if it just came about being in my collection, I would be really happy. <laughs> oh my gosh. Who are you? I love you. Rami Reindeer. Oh my stinking gosh. He's so cute. He reminds me of a specific jelly cat. What am I thinking of? Woody Bear. He reminds me of Woody Bear because of this like sitting position he's in. He looks so soft too. Oh my gosh, he's so cute. Okay, definitely want this one. So right now for my, my wish list for this year, we have the Amusables Reindeer Peanut and Rami Reindeer. Those are my big two right now. All reindeers, huh? What does that say about me? All right, and okay, we got one more page. I don't know how much is gonna be on this next page though. Peanut penguin decoration. Oh my gosh. He's little. He's a baby. He's snowboarding. He's too little to be snowboarding. Oh my gosh. He's so cute. Look at his little hat. Merrick Moose. That's a big boy right there. He's cute. He's kind of goofy looking and I like the goofy looking ones. Christmas jelly cat Jack. Now that's a good idea. Jelly cat. That's some, that's a good one. Don't have a jelly cat Jack yet. Like an actual like normal size one. I have the bag charm. This is adorable. That would be a great Christmas gift for someone who collects jelly cats. Eldo Elf. Not my thing. Not a fan of, of human of human plushies. Cranberry octopus. Oh my gosh, look at him. His little tentacles. They have little 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 peppermint, little peppermint pattern, little peppermint. Oh, he's very cute. I love octopus plushies. I just love their legs. You know what I mean? That's an adorable idea. I don't know if I would go out of my way to purchase it, but I definitely like it a lot. Also, it says from $35, which suggests to me that there are going to be multiple sizes, which will be interesting because they might have like a really big one. Two bashful bunnies, the new colors, nutmeg and ivy. Those are beautiful colors, especially together, but nutmeg bunny is very, very cute. And I might just have to add that one to my list. I love brown. I love how like warm and inviting that color is. That's a cutie. That's a cutie right there. Don't get me wrong. Ivy is too, and I definitely would want the ivy one but if i have to be picky i'll probably pick the nutmeg what's next <gasps> what okay first let's go in order here bashful winter puppy adorable but again this is just the bashful black and cream puppy with a scarf and it's 32 dollars make it make sense not for me i already have a black and cream puppy so for that i could just like knit him a scarf and i would have this <laughs> but this is what got me really excited right here bashful holly bunny this fur texture it's either going to be really really nice or a sensory nightmare i would love to feel this in person because i'm very curious if it's going to be like a curly soft feel or if it's going to be kind of like a rough glittery thing i don't know definitely is one i would have to see in person to decide if i would actually get it or not otherwise it is very cute bashful eevee bunny very very cute the only thing is like i wish that the the lines were kind of going a uh, diagonal as opposed to going horizontally i think that would give it more of like the candy cane peppermint vibe and next is a uh, bashful arctic fox pretty cute simple design i like it not really my thing but good good guy he's a good guy and two more oh my gosh bartholomew bear in winter pajamas adorable 
cool. Those pajamas are super stinking cute. But we run into the same problem where I'm paying $45 for a jelly cat I already have three of, and I'm just paying $45 for an outfit, which sucks. But if you really like it, I understand why it'd be worth it. And a brand new design for our last buddy here, Arlo Hair. He is so weird, but I like him. Look at the ears. Look at the little black tips. His mouth is so cute. He looks really big. What 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 are his dimensions? He's 13.4 inches tall. That's pretty big. And also like half of that is ear. <laughs> I would have to probably see him in person to decide, but he is very cute and I'm very tempted by him. Okay. We just went through the entirety of the upcoming collection for this year's holidays. Very exciting stuff. I'm excited to see a lot of these in person and I'm excited to add a lot of these to my own collection. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you liked it, go ahead and give it a like. And if you're cool, you could subscribe. See you guys in the next video. Bye.